Greetings. Today I want to encourage you to stop talking about manifesting and start creating. In other words, I'm saying don't just be a talker. Be a doer. And when you do, it will speak for itself. In other words, you are to be a conscious creator. Do something. Present something to the world. And in return, you would get back what you so deserve. You see, the law the love of compensation states that you must give. And it will come back to you. Good measure pressed down, shaken together and running over. Shall men give into your bosom. But you see, if you become intellectual and you're always talking about manifesting and all you're doing is listening to videos on the internet with people talking about what they manifest and so on you don't all be under the expectation for something to fall in your lap and you would believe that being woke means being broke <coughs> and also you would believe that to be spiritual mean that you must disdain material things and you will all be coming up with excuses to fit your whole paradigm but i want to say to you my brother and my sisters you are to become a conscious creator you are to be imaginative and creative and you are to let your light so shine before the world that the world will be able to see your works. They'll be able to see the changes that is taking place in your life. Because you see, whatever change you want to see in the world, you must become that change. And that is why I am employing you. I am encouraging you to be a doer. It's always important for you to understand the law of Goya. Get off your ass. Do something. Create something. Produce something. Exchange something. Everything in this world is based on transaction. In other words, everything is a business. It's an investment. So how are you investing your time and your energy? We're living in a world of information and many people can become more consumers of information more than creators those who use the information to change their condition those are the ones who understand this information age more than anyone else so my brother and my sisters be one of the wise ones who would use the opportunity and create his or her reality consciously because you understand that you're living in a digital age you're living in an information age and you're using the information that is available to you to change your life whichever way you want it to be so stop talking about manifesting and start creating do something as i said before create something produce something and give it to the world and it's gonna come back to you so my brother my sister i just want to use those few words of encouragement and wisdom to help to strengthen you and to let you know that if you are already on this path it is because the universe wants you to widen your scope and wants you to transmute your energy into the equivalent of whatever you desire in this three-dimensional world so my brother my sisters do not let anything stop you be not be do not be so easily distracted but stay focused and know what you want and walk towards having and being and doing that which you so desire in this world and that will speak for itself you know sometimes i hate speaking to people who want to speak about a lot of consciousness and want to speak a lot of, of spirituality and these kind of things but yet their life doesn't match what they're saying okay i know that you know all of us you have to start small 
Okay? But once the result is taking place in your life, doesn't matter how small it is, others will be able to see. Okay? So my brothers and sisters, woke up on yourself and be a doer and not just a hearer. Stop talking about manifesting and start creating. Do something. So with that being said, let me say again, if this is the very first time that you're listening to me and what I'm saying, if it makes sense, if it really resonates with you and you haven't subscribed already, I'm definitely encouraging you to subscribe, to like, to comment, and to share this video. Also, if you'd like to follow me on Instagram, if you like to follow me on TikTok, you can follow me at Black Mad Guru. Also, I want to recommend my latest book. It's called Spiritual Recipe for Better Living. And truly, you need a certain recipe to learn to create your reality consciously. And that book has a lot of gems concerning the recipes that you need to create your reality consciously, especially if you're one who grew up to believe in the Bible as literal and secular history. And now I'm actually interpreting the Bible to you, metaphysically, esoterically, and psychologically, and making, making sense of the mysteries that are hidden there, that, 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 that are there to help you to live your life whichever way you want it to be. So I definitely encourage you to get that book. Also, if you would like to be a part of my Patreon community, you're most welcome. And I have a course there for people who are donating 20 or more dollars. It's called the Innocent Science and Technology to Create Your Reality Consciously. Along with that is a bonus course on self-concept. It's all available to you. Okay, just follow your intuition. Also, if you'd like to do a one-on-one -on -one with me, you can reach out to me by way of email. Okay, and after discussion, we can, we know where we go from there. Also, before I leave you, I just want to remind you that if you feel strongly led to support this work, I want to let you know that we have a PayPal and that the link is always down below. So with that being said, my brother and my sister, I just want to say peace. Love you all. Um, out.